abandoned building's history, know it simply as the Murder Hotel. The infamous hotel was run by a mysterious family for several generations until close to In unrelated news, the trivia murder party killer is still on the loose. Up next, Sassafras. This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. Death's in the air. And there's free coffee in the lobby. Only one of you will survive. I know that's a lot of pressure, but just try to have fun. All right. First question. Traditionally, which of these drinks contain alcohol? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I want to show you something. Welcome to the killing room. It's time for some pegging. Okay, now that I've said that out loud, it does sound weird. You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. Okay. Let the games begin. Pick a spot to drop from. It's fun. This was a lot harder to build than you guess. Hey, good work with the death zones. We're not done with you yet. The end of your life isn't the end of your participation. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Let's keep moving. I might hate people, but I love brands. What brand's slogan is, when it rains it pours? This. Lucky guesses. Let's try another one. What was the first antibiotic to be discovered? <laughs> Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. Welcome to room 227. It's the mind meld. Type in an answer that fits this category. Everyone else will answer too. And if anyone matches you, you die. And I do mean anyone. Time's almost up! You didn't answer! That's a real jerk move. Anyway, back to the actual game. Oh super! You're so unpredictable and you get to live! No fun! Let's keep moving. Who wears a tunic? <laughs> Who 
picked this. Ah, oh, crap. Let's try another one. When you play polo on horseback, and we all do, what do you use to smack the ball? Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. Math! It's back, baby! Do as much math as you can before time runs out. The worst math lead will be punished. Let's go! I am here for the math! Only time for one or two more bits of math! Tying is still losing. <laughs> We're here! When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question! In what language was the Gutenberg Bible printed? Who picked this? One of you is still alive. Time for consequences. Let's do a spooky handwriting test. Oh, hey, look! The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. Pay attention to her unique handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will everyone else. Draw a word on the mirror, and maybe you'll trick someone into thinking it's Aunt Mildred's. Let the drawing begin! Pay attention to the words as they appear, and try to spot my auntie. So many convincing words to choose from! Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote, or you die! Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Aww, you got it! This is my second most disappointing experience with a mirror. Let's keep moving. Mm. Oh, I am so behind on sleep. Some of my captives keep getting upset in the middle of the night. It's exhausting. If I try to get my captives to sleep using the Ferber method, what would I need to do? Who <laughs> picked? This. <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I want to show you something. Ah, the spirit of giving. You each get $500. Give some of that money to your friend. The person with the most cash at the end will die. But there's a catch. If one of you ends up with $800 or more, I'll kill the other one instead. Begin. Time for fiscal revelations. So much money, so much pain.
Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Congrats on making it here alive! But can you escape? I'm going to give you a category. Animals with stripes. Tap each answer that fits the category. Let's see the right answers. You move forward one space for each correct answer. You're a little bit closer to escaping. But get this. All ghosts get to play too. If a ghost catches you, they'll steal your life force. Then they can try to escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Time is almost up. Geologic time periods. Countries on the equator. Don't fall behind. Are you afraid of the dark? Numbers that divide into 54. Time is almost up. There's always room in the darkness. Former British colonies. on you. Punctuation marks. You cannot run that ghost forever. Clouds. Time is almost up. The darkness approaches. Power drones. Still some yummy life force. Here comes the next question. Mediterranean Islands. Oh, this one's a nail biter. Where do you think you're going? If you want to break through that barrier, you'll need a perfect answer to this question. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. You have to get all the right answers to escape. 